So I believe it was today that there's an official image released of Wonder Woman or Batman v Superman. Okay, it's the stupidest DC project known to man. I'll admit, when I first saw the picture, I was impressed for the most part, but now I'm thinking, like, why the hell is she getting her own movie? <laughs> I mean, they're just literally throwing her into this Batman Superman film. No development, no one's gonna know who the hell she is, what the hell she can do except calm with people. It's gonna be a freaking waste. Oh, oh, it's a setup movie. Like, shut up. You know why Marvel's so successful? Because they took their freaking time. They developed everybody, gave them their own movie, and then they came together in their freaking Avengers. The most freaking awesome. They didn't throw Captain America and Thor in the same movie, they was gonna work. So why the hell did it work for DC? Hmm? How the hell did it work for DC? It wouldn't. Because no one's seen Ben Affleck as Batman before. Well, they're still used to Christian Bale or Peter King of Florida. All of a sudden, you know, see like, you kidding me? This looks cool for the most part. I mean, it's alright. I mean, I'm not busting my nuts over this like everybody else these days, but then I saw some stupid picture of uh, Some footage that was released at uh, San Diego Comic Con. Apparently, it's a teaser for the new Batman Superman film. It's basically death taken over because Zack Snyder's lost his sense and he's going full retard on the film. Apparently, the footage describes Batman standing on rooftop or something, I guess, with police headquarters, and this arm, body armor thing from Dark Knight Returns, looks exactly like it, honestly, that much I have to admit, so he pulls off this tarp, and it shows the freaking bat signal, based on Dark Knight Returns, and then, and then you see Superman floating in the sky, heat vision all ready to burn his ass up. And apparently that's where the footage ends. <laughs> and I'm thinking to myself, dude, there's no amount of armor that can withstand Superman's heat vision. Nothing. He's a regular dude. Like, get real, people. Get real. <laughs> Alien from another planet versus a regular dude. There's only one way they can end. <laughs> so it's only gonna be Batman one, that's for freaking sure. Like Batman purists out there. Like, stop living in your own basement and get a life. <laughs> Give her the picture, people. And jeez. It's, it's not gonna happen. Batman is not gonna win in that fight. It's just the way it is, you know? And some chump commented on, commented on one of my videos. He was like, oh, the movie's only gonna be about one Superman, why are you kryptonite? I'm like, son, there's no kryptonite in this Superman universe. I'm sure, you gotta leak around that Death Star machine, but he still left the hell out of it. There's nothing on the freaking planet that can stop this guy. So, how the hell is Batman gonna stop him? You tell me, huh? Stupid. So, yeah, until they figure that out, because they're trying to convince me it's gonna be good. <laughs> but, yeah. I don't care either way, so nothing this movie's gonna do to convince me it's gonna be any good. I'm always gonna have my reservations, and I'm usually right too, so. I just don't like the angle they're taking. It's not like Frank Miller, I do not like Dark Knight Returns. So. I'm not sure if they don't want to see Superman be the bad guy. There's no reason for it. I mean, sure, he defeated God. He had no choice in the matter. What else is he going to do? 
not this not talk or something. <laughs> this seems a little rushed to me. They released all this at Comic Con, whatever. Um, still two years away. Do I see a trailer? I mean, a decent trailer like that. I'm not buying it. I don't care. I don't need it. <laughs> it's just stupid. It's just stupid to plan these every two months. I mean, they really just give them bad news on movie. Like Wonder Woman and her own movie. So we can get to know the characters instead of throwing them into one movie thinking it's going to work. Now, have you people seen Batman and Robin? That movie proves too many heroes in the same film is not work. For DC. Marvel is different because they took their time. DC has one Superman film, and they're going to throw everybody from DC Universe in the same freaking movie. I think it's going to work. You guys are retarded. You're stupid. You're stupid. Give me a break. <laughs> no one's thinking logically. No one is thinking logically about this. Except for me. I'm sure there's some of you that agree with me out there. I'm not many of them, but I'm sure there's someone out there that agrees with me. All of us that have sense out there that agree with me. I don't know, I just don't like it. I, just, I don't like the way they're taking this. I mean, the road they're taking this movie is it's ridiculous. Nothing out of a Superman sequel to a Superman movie with Batman make a movie take over. In every way possible. And they're going to have him win somehow. I don't know how, but they're going to have him win. Because Zack Snyder's a dumbass. Yeah, he's stupid. <laughs> this is the same guy who's going to direct Justice League. So. So she know what to expect from that, huh? Freaking 50 year old Batman somehow to play alongside Superman and the rest of the meta humans in DC Universe. Give me a break. You can see why I'm not supporting this series. It's, it's stupid. It's stupid. I mean, the main Spider Man series is better than this crap. At least the second. First one had its its flaws, but good ones, not new ones. New ones. And it was better than this to stupid Tobey Maguire movie, so. <laughs> yep. It's a different topic. Yeah, I'm looking at the picture right now. I see a little glimpse of Superman floating in the lighting from Dash Sun. I like him. What the hell is he doing in Gotham in the first place? I guess that's going to be explained in the film, but the more they release for this movie, the more I'm concerned I get. I mean, that's not good. <laughs> I'm, used to I'm used to companies like Sony giving me everything for their movies, but I feel like they're just doing this to try and calm people down. All it's doing is making me more concerned. So. Yeah, Mr. Snyder, you need a better strategy, buddy. <laughs> Don't go some nuts and get a better story for this movie, huh? I don't have, we don't have it. Who knows, maybe tomorrow they'll release their picture of Aquaman. So that the general audience can laugh alongside us. We don't know how ridiculous this movie is going to be. Huh?